This segment of Hack 5 is brought to you by Netflix. It's time once again to check port 995. Actually, we're not going to do emails right now. I know we got some fantastic ones, but I was listening to your segment and I thought I'd do some fun stuff in the C block oh. with some Linux tools to do kind of the same thing. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Show me, show me. Yeah. But we'll do the questions next show week because those show are good me. ones. Um, get this, right? First of all, uh, disconnect.me is actually yeah. up on GitHub. So you can do like a git oh, nice. clone the URL, yeah. get the source code. It's all JavaScript because it's Sweet. an extension. So hey, can... I know JavaScript. Well, there you kind go. Of. Well, oh, oh, yeah, the, the, the Code Academy yeah. teaches JavaScript. Well, um, so there you go. So you can be peer reviewed. And I kind of would trust it. But here's the thing. Why go through the whole thing of having an extension, which you raise a good point. I mean, you install an extension in your browser. It's like installing an app like, on your okay, phone. You so trust what it's going to do is legit. Yeah, I yeah. want to see the source code. But that's cool. It's on GitHub, so awesome. Yeah. Uh, another way to do it, though, is using one of my favorite tools. It's called ngrep. Do I have it installed? No. sudo apt get install tack y ngrep. There we go. <laughs> the end. That should only take a second. Okay. okay. And so the beautiful thing about ngrep is, just like I was talking about earlier about those awesome text processors mm -hmm. in Linux, you know, sed, awk, grep is one of the greatest ones because I can say, here's a text file full of stuff, grep that file and only show me what I'm looking for. Oh, yeah, okay. Well, in this case, ngrep allows you to do the same thing except instead of a file, it's the network. So I can oh. take a look at all of the network traffic going through my computer and I can yeah. focus on using either a regular expression or just something very simple like, you know, uh, a word in quotes, just find that one thing. So you're going to be looking for a, one of those websites that collects your data? Yeah. Well, I'm going to use okay, Facebook cool. as an example because Mark Zuckerberg, all he wants to do is sell your privacy for money. Right. Of course he right. does. Um, have your babies. What? Wait, what? Huh? Okay. So moving on, <laughs> what we need to do is t do ngrep and then tack Q for quiet because it can be pretty chatty. Uh, tack D uh, for your interface and any in this case. I'm going to use all my interfaces. And then all you have to do is specify what you're looking for. And in this case, I'm going to do Facebook.com. I'm already logged into Facebook. Mm -hmm. I can come over here and see that checking out the awesome Hack 5 Facebook Heck page. Yeah. And, um, and so now I'm going to do, get this, tack capital K. And that does kill. And what kill, it does is... Okay. Whenever it sees Facebook, kill all processes. Well, it's going to send a dis well, not a disconnect. It's like a reset packet in HTTP. Oh. But yeah, it, it kills it okay. just like a process. And um, and then we're going to have to specify how many. I'm going to say ten, whatever. One would probably do the job. But if I do that, I'm going to find out that the operation isn't permitted because you need to do it as root. So let me sudo bang bang that. Okay. <laughs> So now I'm running it, and you can see like interface, any, it's matching Facebook.com. Okay. And if I were to come over here to, um, to I don't know, like if I click on info, you're going to notice that this is not going to work. This is going to fail. In fact, if I try to refresh this page, the page oh, is not available now. Oh, so the now. page is killed. So you kind of have to like think of it as this would be a great hacker way to do it. Like, okay, I'm going to Facebook right now, right? Yeah. So turn, disable my ngrep script, yeah. go to Facebook. I'm done looking at Facebook. Now I want to go over to, since I'm still running it, let's go to TechCrunch. Mm -hmm. And so TechCrunch is notorious for this. You see these things on the bottom, um, on the side here? Yeah, they're little can, share things. I can share it on Facebook, Twitter, and all this other yeah. stuff. And as soon as I mouse over this, it disappears. <gasps> oh, and you'll notice that's cool. in my log here, it was killing these connections, and it's because they were making attempts to apps.facebook.com. Apps.facebook.com? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's got all sorts of fun, interesting stuff that you could uh, parse through. But just wanted That's to point awesome. out that, yes, the Chrome extension maybe is a little more user-friendly, yeah. but there's... It's Linux. There's more than one way to kill a cat. Yeah, that's to totally your way of doing it. <laughs> yeah. I just like that. I'm, I'm thinking, like, now, huh, there would probably be a really easy... It's, it's like... I'm sure this already exists, right? Like we're finding out with Kill All the Humans. Um, well, there's always so many ways to do it. A lot of stuff already exists, but yeah. it's almost like thinking about it, like instead of like an application-based firewall, mm -hmm. thinking of it like a, like a, I don't know, website-based web application firewall. If that doesn't exist already, let's cash in it on it. It will. <laughs> yeah, our new Bay Area startup, web application firewalls <laughs> with a Z. Well, cool. That's awesome. Three. I'm glad there's, um, you know, I know that we have the Chrome extension, but there's a specific one for you Linux gurus. Yeah, yeah. And Sweet. I can replace Facebook with MySpace. Like anyone's ever going to go there. 
Huh? Space. Yeah. Take that, my that space. That still exists. I don't know. <laughs> All right, we'll be right back after a quick break. With trivia! Netflix streams TV episodes and movies directly to your home, saving you time and money. Instantly watch unlimited TV episodes and movies streaming directly to your PC, your Mac, or right to your TV with your PS3, Xbox 360, or Nintendo Wii console. For a limited time, get your free trial membership. Go to netflix.com slash HAK5 and sign up now. Netflix is now available in the UK and Ireland. Our viewers over there can get the same free trial as in the US. Just check out netflix.co.uk slash hack5 or netflix.ie slash hack5. It's time once again for trivia. And the Technoless photo of the week. Oh, which one are we doing first? <laughs> Technoless. All right, fine. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, okay, what is this? you'll really like it. Yeah. This week I bring you a compilation of cats. Ooh. Yes, a yeah. compilation of a cats. Compilation I know. Cats. Here are some photos from a few of our viewers, thanks to Jargon and his cat Nikki, Patrick and Chloe, who kind of looks like Hitler the cat, Ghost and Mimi, and Leo and his kitty Millie, and they are all. Freaking adorable. Nice. I want all of them. Take them over to my house. Just there's, kidding. There's something about hackers and cats. They I know. Just go like right they, they just, they do. They go so well together. They lay on laptops. They type things for you. It never makes sense. But yeah, you can send your photos to feedback at hack5.org. Oh. Subject line technolus photo to submit yours, and they don't necessarily have to be cats. Or cat five. Yeah. Or cat five e. They could be parrots. Or cat six. Gosh. Listen, don't send us twisted pair. How's that? <laughs> let's find out about trivia. Let's let's do that. All right. Last week's question was NFC support, near field communication, was introduced in what version of Android? Uh, meringue pie. Uh, lemon Close. drops. More closer. Uh, more closer. Figs. I have no idea. Figs. What? <laughs> it's gingerbread, right? Gingerbread. Yes. And uh, I don't know if that was a hard one or not. I don't run Android, so. I don't know. We'll see. In Soviet Russia, Android runs you. Oh, Soviet Russia. This week's question is, which of these wasn't included in the Jeopardy winning supercomputer Watson? 120 terabytes storage, that's a lot of storage. 16 terabytes of RAM, that's a lot of RAM. 2880 Power 7 processor cores, or the complete text of Wikipedia. Hmm. And you can answer over at hack5.org slash trivia for your chance to win some awesome swag. Well, if it's Wikipedia, then that would mean that it would have to go out to the internet every single time to find an answer, you know? Kind of like what you guys are about to do to find out the answer to the trivia question. Whoa, it just got recursive. Ah, uh, ah it's tap it All right, you guys can go over to hack5.org slash follow to get to all the links to the social networks that we're on, downloads, feeds, and make sure to subscribe to the show because that's the best way to support us. We well, well, also have tons of new fun little goodies, a lot of inexpensive, cool, fun add-on stuff for all your sorts hack of hacks over at uh, hakshop.com. So shop with us at the hack shop. And again, don't forget about that party, May 3rd, hack5.org slash 1111 to get all the details. Baltic Pub, it's going to be awesome. It's our sweet 16 if you count the zero. It is. Yeah. And hack tips. Yay. Every other Friday. Without further ado, I'm Darren Kitchen. I'm Shannon Morse. Trust your technologist. Yes, These are not the packets you are looking for. Everybody want the dinosaur. You gotta see it, it's so funny. Okay. All right. Yay. <laughs> Kittens, dinosaurs, internets, hacking the things and drinking the coffee is before the show. That's how I've always said it. Yahoo. That's what you say when you like ride a horse. You say Yahoo. Whatever. 